Okay, third graders, so you're going to be in charge of making a color wheel in Sketchpad, and you are going to be making the basic color wheel, which is just the primary and secondary colors. You are going to make sure that you label all of them, which ones are primary and which ones are secondary. You can use whatever shapes you want. I use triangles within a circle, but you could make, you know, do yours out of circles, whatever shapes you want to do. It just has to be a color wheel with the primary and secondary colors. Okay, so that's just for third grade. Third grade, that is your assignment. If you're wondering how to get the shapes, the different shapes, I did triangles, but if you wanted a different shape, you could go up to the yellow star on the left-hand side and click that, and then go up to the red circle um, and click that, and you'll get the option of many different shapes, and then you just drag it along. Um, then if you want to add the text, please do add the text. Um, it's down in the red circle with the T. So fourth graders, you are going to make a color wheel as well, but you're going to add in not just the primary, secondary colors, you're going to also do the tertiary colors. The tertiary colors are the circles that I put in between the primary and secondary colors, and those are the ones that you need to create. Fifth graders, you are going to make a color wheel with the primary and secondary colors, the tertiary colors, and you're going to be adding in images. To add in images, you need to go up to the toolbar on the left-hand side and then click on the smiley face and then go up to the red button that says load image and then you'll be able to search the web and get images.